another vlog. So for today, we will do vacuuming. So we got this Dyson V11 Absolute Extra a few days ago. This is our first time having this one. So let's try using this and we will see if it's really worth the price. I have heard so much good things and reviews about these, about this um, vacuum. My workmates and my friends are telling me that it's really very light, it's very handy to use, and it's really worth the price. So let's try and use it because it's still different if we're the ones that are going to experience it. So please keep on watching. We will attach the wand. So that red bit there clicks in. Today, we're just going to use the high torque cleaning head. So what red bit again, clips through there. Now the moment of truth. Let's see. Little, it's very light little. It's actually quite light. I'm only little, as you can see, but it's really light. It's very light. No, I know, no etchos compared to our previous one so let's try and then you can choose what sort of settings do you want so we have here the echo mode medium and the boost we will use the medium mode for today this one huh it's very very light so we are halfway vacuuming the bedroom and look at the dirt oh can you see that there's so much dirt and take note Tabalang has already vacuumed this room a few minutes ago using our corded vacuum our old vacuum which I will show you shortly and the good thing with this is you could also change the attachments on the bottom if you wanted to, which is really good. So if you want to use the, like the crevices area or something like that. And as I have said, I have heard so much good things and reviews about this vacuum from my colleagues and my friends that it's really worth the price. It's a, This is a bit costly. However, if it's worth the price and it makes your job easier and it's more convenient for you, then why not, diba? Right? So let us continue cleaning the room. I will also show you on how to empty the bin later on. So let's keep vacuuming guys. We have already vacuumed two bedrooms already and we have pretty decent sized bedrooms. And look at the remaining time of the vacuum. We, we've, we could still use it for at least 19 minutes. So I think I'm really liking it. So let us go and empty the bin. People, come with me. So this is our old vacuum, guys. We had this for more than four years now. This is the Electrolux Ultra Flex. And see how bulky it is. It's really heavy. Anyway, I don't really like vacuuming because of the heaviness and the bulkiness of this one. And as well as cleaning it afterwards is quite time consuming. I have a new love now, Lang. Whatever, Lang. I think it's a really a good idea having the Dyson V11, especially if you vacuum a lot of times. We do vacuum at least once a week. So for those who have little children or those who have pets or anything, it's, that one was really handy because it's not bulky and it's easier to empty the bin and everything. You just have to do like that and it's good to go. So... Yeah, that's my new love, Daddy. So stupid, ni lang. Anyway, take two guys, cause I was scared away and the camera wasn't rolling. So this is how you empty the bin. So that red button there, press that one to remove it. Make sure it's recording, huh? 
<laughs> and this red bit here, you just have to push it down. See? It's very convenient and it's quite hygienic as well. And then when you push it back, just you will just hear it click. That's it. Easy. I'm little and I find it quite light to use. So as I have said, and I've been mentioning it quite a lot already on this vlog, that I have been liking it and I like it. And this is my first impression. And I hope this will gonna last. Anyways, that's all for now, guys. And I'll see you on my next videos. Keep safe, everyone. Bye.